Antonio Caroli to win the 2022 AMA Pro Motocross Nationals. No, I I don't think he's going to win them. He's not even planning on racing all of them. KTM is trying to pay him back. Not trying to, but they want to pay him back. He wants to do something on his bucket list, come over here in America and do a few of them. I think he's going to do the first couple, maybe three, four. We will see depending upon how well he's doing. Do I think he's going to win? No, I don't. Do I think he's got speed to win motos? Yes. Could he possibly get an overall? I guess theoretically, yeah. The dude is 36 years old. He's one of the best there ever was. So why couldn't he come over here and whack some American boys? You know, glad I'm not racing because A, I won't even qualify. And B, if I somehow did, I'd be getting my ass lapped by him. So it, it, it's 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 pretty stellar that we have a superstar like this from MXGP coming over here. Uh, you know, Hurlings did it and was able to win. The big story is, is Hurlings going to be the guy to come over here? Is he going to win the series? Because he's got a good shot if he does come over here. Antonio Caroli, he's more of that, like, underdog, where you know he has the speed, but is he going to? He says that he's done all the same prep as if he was going to race the MXGPs, and I'm sure he's going to have just as much support However, you know, the rules are a little bit differently, so the bike is going to be different over here, and it might take a little while to get used to. So, and, and personally, I don't think the tracks are as difficult over here. They don't get as gnarly. I, I know that's, that's <laughs> foot equals mouth because our tracks get really, really gnarly. Iron Man was probably one of the most roughest tracks I have ever ridden in my entire life. You know, and then the sand tracks that we have, but it's a little bit of semantics trying to compare the the two. I haven't been over to Europe just from what I hear from other riders. Uh, let me know in the comments what you guys think. Is he gonna win some motos? Is he gonna get some podiums? Is he gonna be just top ten? How serious is Caroli? And if nothing else. Coombs should be happy because this is going to bring a lot more press that is much needed because of all the, the downfall of Peacock and I uh, just just hard to try to find a provider to show this stuff on TV. You know, truthfully, like, I'm still a big believer that, uh, granted, there, there's a budget problem in there. See, I'm, I'm, I'm digressing. And do something kind of like the CrossFit Games where if you don't have a full-blown TV gig, you do it on the internet, right? You just YouTube live it, put it on your website live, maybe even charge a subscription to do that, and we all get to watch the races and footage however you want, and from there, you know, you can build it back up, but it's a, it's a third-party, third way of potentially making everything work by just streaming it on your own. I know CrossFit's done it. They do a good job with it. Motocross could learn from them. Anyway, it's Johnny Evanopper.